What is going on everybody? It's your boy BJ coming at you with another video. And I hope that you guys are all having a beautiful and fantastic day. I'm so happy to have you on my channel again. It really does mean so much to me that you support me and my channel just for you to come on here and view this so you can learn something new to help you. Uh, I'm just here to inspire, motivate, and encourage you to live your absolute best life every single day. And it just means a lot when you do come on my channel to check these out. Uh, go ahead and drop me one of these, a thumbs up, so it can circulate out into the YouTube universe. Let me know that you're here. Uh, let me know that you're all in on this. And let's go ahead and get into the details of this video. All right, guys, I'm going to talk to you about the number one thing that will make any woman, I said any woman, regret losing you. This is something that, you know, many of us want to know because some of us, uh, many of us in life go through breakups or we go through unfair situations uh, maybe you were with someone that you just loved and just adored and desired so much. And unfortunately, the relationship didn't work out. And it sucks. I know how that feels. I've been there myself. And, you know, the one thing that I've found is that, you know, we always want to make it. We always want to get it back. We want that old thing back, right? Like Jay-Z said in one of his songs, uh, we just want that old thing back. We just want to get it back. We want to we want to feel their warmth, feel them close to us. We want to hold their hand. We want to kiss them. We want to you know, hug them. We want to, you know, make love. We want to get intimate. Like we want to do all these things and just have them back again. But, uh, one of the things I've learned as well in my own journey of growing is that sometimes the breakup is exactly what you needed because it's going to lead to this thing I'm going to share with you. That's going to make them regret losing you. You want to know what that one thing is? personal development yes personal development you thought i was going to tell you like some magic trick or something like that didn't you <laughs> well in a sense it almost kind of works that way because when you start working on yourself when you start investing in yourself this is when it will make other people a woman or a friend or whoever it is regret losing you because when you invest and work on yourself you become a higher version of yourself now, this could be anything. It could be you finally starting to hit the gym or getting your workout in so you can start losing that weight and building the body that you've always said you want to build. It could be that you've invested in a new program uh, to learn how to build a business or, or create a brand for yourself. Uh, it could be you wanting to start a YouTube channel and you finally started your channel. Uh, it could be you wanting to start to, uh, you know, build a, a bike or something like that or a car or work on a car or something like that. Whatever it is. You start to focus on yourself and your passions and you really start to work on growing yourself. Or maybe you invested in a personal one-on-one -on -one coach, a life coach, uh, to really start working on yourself. I help people all the time uh, with coaching. So when you start to invest in yourself, what happens is you start to raise your inner magnetism. You start to become a higher uh, vibration, a higher version of yourself. You start to become healthier. You start to look and feel better. You develop more confidence and you just feel better about yourself. You don't have to go into these tricks of trying to go out and trying to hook up with chicks and hook up with girls to make yourself feel better and be like, yeah, you know, um, I'm feeling a, uh, I'm feeling a lot better now because, uh, you know, it's all this false validation. Like, yeah, look at all these chicks I'm hanging out with. You're posting all these pictures on social media to make yourself look better. Like you're the man. Like, no. Girls see right through that and it's actually unattractive, especially if you're trying to do that for a response. And nine times out of 10, when you're doing that for a response, you're not gonna get a positive response out of that. It's actually gonna backfire on you. And it's not gonna work in your favor because when she sees that, what could happen is that she sees you're trying to go out to get back at her. She's actually not attracted to that. And then what could essentially happen is she could end up doing the same thing if she's gonna be petty, um, you know, which, you know, girls can be petty sometimes. If she's going to be petty and does that back, it's actually going to crush you and hurt you a lot more than you trying to do that to hurt her. Don't do it. Be organic about it. Work on yourself. Take care of yourself. So that way, when you work on yourself and you start to grow your personal power and you start to invest in yourself, it will happen so naturally to where you start to look and feel better that it vibrates out. And guess what? Because you're not so focused on worried about her, and you're focused on yourself, that's what's gonna attract her back to you. That's just gonna make her regret losing you because you're not blowing her up off the hook. You're not sending her text messages 
multiple text messages after midnight saying, I miss you, I miss you, I can't live without you. I just want to kiss you and hug you. I want to smell your perfume and I just want you here so bad. You're not being desperate. Desperation is a repellent. And when you're not being desperate and you're working on yourself, like I said, building your own personal power, you're becoming a better man, you're becoming a higher, better version of yourself, this is going to make her regret losing you guys. It's going to make her regret it. And then it's going to get to a point to where it's not only her that wants to get with you, but it's going to be multiple women that want to get with you because you're just so magnetic. You got this vibe about you. It's like, dang, like, I want a piece of that. <laughs> and it's going to feel so good. Because you feel good, you look good, you have a self-love and appreciation and value for yourself to where you won't even have to chase anybody anymore, man. Like it's going to be coming at you like hotcakes, like hotcakes on a Saturday morning. You know, it's just like when you start to work and grow on yourself, it vibrates out. It really does. When you're just genuinely enjoying life and having fun, being you, being comfortable in the skin you're in. It's going to draw more women to you. Even that person that left that said that she didn't want to be with you will be drawn back to you. So just live your life. Work on yourself. Don't focus on what somebody else is doing. Focus on what you're doing and become a higher, better version of yourself. And watch what happens to you. Nothing but good things will happen. Trust me. Try it out for yourself. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hope you really enjoyed it. Uh, if you got something out of this, drop me one of these, a thumbs up so I can circulate out into the YouTube universe so that more people can see the content that I'm putting out. And as always, be sure to hit that bell icon. That way you can be notified whenever I do post a new video to my channel. Otherwise, you won't be notified if you don't hit the bell icon. So make sure you hit that bell icon. I'll put some other videos up here for you to go ahead and check out. And as usual, I love you. God bless you. And I'll see you, oh, before I go, I do have one-on-one -on -one coaching slots open for this month. So if you're interested in one-on-one -on -one coaching with me, if you want to learn how you can become a better version of yourself, if you want to grow, if you want to learn how to become more magnetic and have love chasing you, where you don't ever have to chase love again, be sure to send me an email or go to my website uh, down below. Uh, definitely send me an email for sure, though. And then we can go ahead and set you up with one-on-one -on -one coaching sessions. But as usual, I love you. God bless you. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace.